video was made possible by EA Game Changers. <laughs> Welcome back to Joy's Creative Finger and a special thanks to EA Fire Monkeys for providing me with early access to the latest update. The new Fine Dining Live event starts on September the 3rd for 9 days. Everything you need to create the finest dining experience under the stars, collect craft items to unlock new prizes and choose the ones you want. As usual, this is a crafting event and you need to set down some crafting stations and it's quite simple, just follow the prompts in your game when you have downloaded the update. There's a yellow exclamation mark icon above your furniture tab, just click on that and the event item would be available. So just click on the candle stations and I always say set down all four at the same time. And then the next thing you want to do is get four sims at your location and even more if you want to but go right ahead and click on each of the candle stations and get them to work simultaneously um, so that they can take advantage of the 23 second uh, duration to get 50 candles from each station now the next time you go through this it's going to be two hours and 30 minutes so you want all four doing this at the same time now this isn't my game as usual everything is going to be unlocked at this stage as you can see and we can go right ahead and see what prizes we're going to unlock assuming we finish on time so this is the wondrous wall pack and it's just the one beautiful wallpaper that i'm going to set down here fine gold lines it's called and i'm going to put it up in this warehouse that i've gotten ready for this live event and on the next floor up right here Let's quickly have a look at it. I always want to see what it looks like when you put it up in a double height room and this is just beautiful. I mean, this place has just got some fazaz instantly. It's gorgeous. I love it. Look at it on stairs. I think that's quite nice. And then you've got the other one on the corner here against the black wall. I think it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I wish we had some more. <laughs> I'm always wanting more. Let's quickly go ahead and see what else we would unlock as we go along. Let's purchase the red carpet treatment. And let's quickly put those down. So they come in pieces and you can build them up the way you want. So you could have, say, a square or a runway. You could get really creative with these pieces because they've got corners, as you can see here. Look at that very nice I'm not gonna go on with those and do pay attention to the prizes that will follow on uh, when you want to purchase the next one <laughs> so I guess that would play a big part in controlling how far we can go with our creativity unless you are quite rich in the game we also unlock at this stage the silver and the gold bollards let's put that one alongside this section and the gold one across the way with the red carpets just there please do note the follow-on prizes should you want to place down another piece now let's have a proper look at these they're very nice it's got that marbly touch i love the bollards i think it's gorgeous and as i say this could go on for days you could just continue to extend that carpet to wherever you want to wherever style or design you choose Thing it's really nice I wish the bollards here were rose gold um, yeah I just think that would have been nice <laughs> okay next we have on the rocks and those are actually ice sculptures they look amazing let me quickly set those down and have a proper look at them and it appears we're unlocking more at each stage there was an event I'm not sure what event it was but there was an event where we um, we're unlocking one item the stage <laughs> in this case we're unlocking quite a few and that's really nice so let me set down the rose gold menu over here I've already put down the black one and the black ice sculpture would go over in the corner here and without having to go over every price for the next one because the first is free uh, just pay attention to the next price for your second piece we've got some flooring gray slate tile I think that's gorgeous for your fine dining hall and these are the prizes let's quickly go ahead and see what they look like so i think you can admire these and there are some options for the menu here that's nine seconds and this is 15 seconds agonize <laughs> okay let's see what they do 
Of course, Admire is always the same action. He is completely shocked and, you know, dumbfounded at the same time. And she is making a choice. And that's a beautiful rose gold stand right there. And then we have the black one over here and he's on a 15 minute agonizing um, option to decide what he's going to eat. And then we've got the black one over here, which is just fabulous. These are amazing pieces. There's so much we're going to be able to do. <laughs> Let's quickly go ahead and see what else we unlock at the next stage. We have flower and power. Let's quickly get that and see what that's about. So tall copper lamp will set you in the corner here. Let me just adjust that. And then we have the black tall lamp. Let's set you down here. Okay. We've got the peach flower vase and it's really tiny. <laughs> Let's put it all the way down here because I'll set it up on a surface eventually. Okay, just here. And then we've got the yellow flower vase over here. It's very tiny. I would assume that would go on a table for your fine dining. And these are the prizes. Okay, let's have a look. So this is the tall rose gold lamp, or it's copper actually. <laughs> and you can switch that on and off if you want to. It's gorgeous for decorating your dining hall. And we've got the black one here. And you can use it outside as well. This build has covered up the entire outdoor available space, so otherwise I'd have set it outside. This is the peach flower vase that should be able to go up on a table. I'm sure we'll get those and I'll put that up. And then we have the yellow flower vase right here. Ever so tiny, but of course it's lovely. Right, let's go ahead and unlock the next thing. We have the heater and potted plant. Those look very lovely. And let's have a quick look. We've got the black outdoor heater. Let's set it down here. We've got the silver outdoor heater. So these do go outside as well. We have the white concrete plant. Let's put it here. And we have the gray concrete plant there. These are the prizes for your records. Let's go ahead and have a closer look. I love, love, love these. Of course, you can switch that on and off. It's already on because Sims are in here, so it's automatic. And this white concrete plant is gorgeous. Yeah, and you can interact with it, as you can see. This is the black one. And we have this gorgeous concrete plant on the side as well. I love the shape of that concrete uh, base that the plant is in. <laughs> and now they're gardening. The next thing to unlock is the flora and fences. Let's get that. They go outdoors and indoors, remember that, but we're setting them down indoors. As mentioned before, let's start with a round gold torellus. This is beautiful. Let's put it here. And then we've got the round silver. Right here. Then we've got the fine white partition. Let's put it here. And we've got the fine black partition. Oh, uh, it seems as though I haven't put down the round silver. <laughs> Let's get rid of one of these and put down the round silver. That looks like rose gold. Anyway, it's silver according to the records and these are the prizes for your next one. Okay, here we go. This is gorgeous. This is so nice. I love, you know, the little plants creeping up on that and it's actually ceiling high. You can't see that, but it is. And it's just beautiful. This is the white partition. That's gorgeous. It's obviously got the rose gold, you know, accents inside of it. And then this is the black collection over here, which is just really beautiful and exquisite. I think it's fabulous. Look at that. This Torellus is just gorgeous. Let's go ahead and get some more items down. We've got the contemporary cloak room here. Wow. They look good. Let's quickly set them down and have a closer look. We've got the gold coat rack. Let's set it down here. And then we've got the rose gold coat rack. Let's put it across this way. 
Then we've got the fine dark reception. Can't wait to interact with these. And we have the fine white reception. These are the prizes for the next piece. Let's have a quick look. The fine white reception has some interactions. Eight hours is amazing. So you can keep them there for a while. And look at her go. It's very nice, very upscale. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I absolutely love this. Also, you can get another sim to walk in and complain for eight hours. Wow, that's an entire shift. And she's mad as well, look at her. <laughs> anything else there you go she is now talking to her and she is enraged perhaps her reservation can't be found and she's really lost it well this is good so there's some interaction with this that lasts a while so if that's what you want you've got it and we've got the coat rack back here so you can keep your personal belongings but it works as a wardrobe so you can browse clothes and get into the cast feature that's amazing and this is the other collection in a different shade I think it's beautiful and very finely put together I have to say the finishing is brilliant if you play this game some years ago when we started <laughs> it's nothing compared to what it looks like now this is amazing just amazing the detail is brilliant okay let's quickly go ahead and see what else we need to put down we'll unlock the sit aside pack and let me put those down we've got the fine gray triple couch with some cushions on it that's beautiful let's set it down and then we've got the white triple fine white triple with some cushions too the fine white side table will go underneath that beautiful vase and the black one will go underneath the black vase and these are the prizes for the next piece that you choose to set down they are very expensive let's have a closer look <laughs> it's got lovely cushions and oh well they disappeared because sims i assume are coming to sit on them and this is the plant up on a stool which is really beautiful yeah i was right the sims are sitting on them and just like some of the beds that are recently released in the game the cushions would disappear when the sims use them same as happened in the corner here with this beautiful white couch and now you have a better look at that plant up on the white side table there beautiful absolutely beautiful let's quickly go ahead and see what else we need to unlock and put down we have the so fantastic collection <laughs> so what so fantastic <laughs> they obviously go with the other ones that we've put down we've got a fine white seat let me put it here this one doesn't come with any cushions and we've got the fine white sofa it's a double and it's got its cushions too and I think the same would happen when a sim goes to sit on it cushions would disappear we've got the double gray and we've got the single gray we also have a white wash coffee table let's put it over here and we've got the walnut coffee table let's put it over here with a walnut reception sort of <laughs> these are the prices take note of those uh, they are a pretty penny they certainly are okay let's go ahead and have a close-up of these they are the same we've just now got a double and a single sofa well chair and you know we've got this lovely walnut coffee table which is just really nice perhaps the white table could go with these as well they should <laughs> and the walnut could go here too <laughs> this is the fine white sofa it's a one star and the actions are the same as you would expect with normal sofas that we have in the game and that's the coffee table very nice let's go ahead and unlock the next prize that would be dinner is served i can't wait to see these you know we unlocked some restaurant tables in the sim chase event and they were not interactive now in the pictures for this update these tables are supposedly interactive so seeing the actions would be fabulous and I've always wanted nice fine dining tables in the game where the sims could sit down and eat good meals you know at a table and interact and to see this in the game I've always said sims free play do give us what we ask for within reason I am so impressed to see this uh, and hopefully I'm going to see that the interactions are 
fabulous so I'm just setting these down really quickly uh, this is a single one that's fine for romantic dining isn't it <laughs> and we've got a small white one let's place it over in the corner here and I did this so you could see it goes right up against that Torellis fabulous huh let me turn that around because I think that you have to place the seats in the direction of the place setting you know um, and do the same over in the corner here now I'm going to get my sims back in so that they can enjoy this and show us how it works these are the prizes however just take note of that um, and yeah <laughs> you could let me know what you think about those prizes in the comments down below <laughs> Now let's get started with this one here. It's beautiful. Look at the blue seats. So you can enjoy a meal for an hour or two hours plus. And likewise, it would be the same with this one. And here they come. You see, this is just what I wanted. You know, the one we had in Santa's rustic farmhouse, it was sort of, uh, what's the word? It's fabulous, but it's too grand and medieval. <laughs> But these are just perfect, fine dining, excellent, good meal, great interaction, they're talking, I am hoping to see someone drink, and we have the same over on the side for a bigger uh, party, I would say. Oh, see, he's not going over because the plates are set in the other direction on this table, so the seats have to come along so that he can actually sit down and eat. So you can't just, you know, put chairs all around let me get the seats over here and get the other one over here as well that way they can actually use it and this one too <laughs> you know it's just occurred to me i should have just turned the table around <laughs> that's what happens when you focus in too hard or stare into a screen for hours okay now you can see he's coming along and out comes a beautiful plate of food and if another sim came along he would interact with that sim as you can see with the other tables the clink and drink is the next to unlock and those look amazing let's quickly have a good look we have the maroon curtain arch wow oh these can just go against any window without the exterior of the house having a black frame <laughs> and then we've got the cream curtain arch no I've picked up the wrong one it's up top here the cream curtain arch would go here and it's got a black rim as you can see then we've got the fine gold drinks cart like the sophisticated socialite live event those were oval but these are rectangular shaped and then we've got the fine silver drinks cart we can set that down there and then we've got the fine black buffet gorgeous and huge and the fine white would have the rose gold rims wouldn't it these are the prizes so take a good look at that now let's go ahead and see what we can interact with I'm pretty sure about the drinks cart uh, let me get a sim free stop complaining and we should be able to get the sims to wait for a customer and then order a drink where is my next sim there order a cupcake drink so it's the same in terms of the actions and then she brings out a tray of course she does and let's have a good look at the other one over here it's just silver the other one was gold and it's got a different arrangement of bottles and ice pitchers and so on now this big buffet table has some interactions this is amazing and if you click on any one wow eight hours I love that there are some really good long interactions with this she stoops down she gets a drink I assume or <laughs> And there she said somewhere to have a drink that's lovely so they don't really need a bar like the sophisticated socialite event they can sit anywhere apparently and then let me stop you madame I want to see if I can place some items up on the buffet table since it's a buffet table <laughs> and um, you know basically see what the grid placement is like so there it is oh wow that's good and let me try out the oyster platter 
I can find one in this game. Yay, there it is. It does, it goes up there. So it's it's going to be interesting what you choose to do in your game with these. It's amazing, it's beautiful. Oh, the rose gold and white is just very beautiful. The next thing to look at properly are these arches. I think they are fabulous for maybe an outdoor setting for the dinner or something. It's just really beautiful. I'm tapping on it and you can't really do anything with that. I thought those little objects up top were lights or something. So I was just tapping away. <laughs> no, it's not. It's just the arch. And yeah, look at it from a window perspective here. It's nice. I'm very impressed with all these items. I really am. I'm very excited. And then we claim the grand prize, which is the fine diner. And it's a beautiful house. Don't forget to look in the description down below for links to other um, videos associated with this update. There are six of them in addition to this one. And you get to see the grand tour for the fine diner, which is the grand prize for this live event. Thank you so much for watching and if you've not subscribed and you want to please do so and don't forget to click the little notification bell on the side so you are notified of other uploads. Thanks again and I'll see you again soon in the next video. Bye!